Hello and welcome back to Sonic Adventure, where we are searching for Amy, <laughs> doing something, getting stuck in walls. There's a very large ID card there. Where could it lead? Well, I guess we'll find out, won't we? Yeah. If I can grab it. Yeah, this it is, is one of the many giant. games that chooses to map everything to one button. I appreciate the thought <laughs> of wanting to keep things simple, but also it doesn't really work out so well. We, we can handle a couple of buttons, you know? Oh, Speed Highway. I thought this was from Sonic Adventure 2. That's a radical highway you're thinking of. It is, isn't it? This is the slightly less radical... That's why uh, I was wondering, I, I thought in Sonic Generations there was two levels from Sonic Adventure 2, and I was like, what? Uh, because it was this, and then uh, City Escape, but little did I know. Yeah, it's it's interesting, because I, I felt the same way that the, the vibe of this level and the vibe of Sonic Adventure 2 generally are very similar. They both go for that uh, cityscape realistic tone. Whereas I think a lot of the other levels in, in Sonic Adventure have a more surreal tone. You know, like, Emerald Coast is, you know, sure that's realistic enough, but it is presented in, in a more cartoony fashion. And then you've got levels like Windy Valley that aren't realistic at all. And then we just played in Twinkle Park, which has a different tone. And so I, I feel like the... I would have put... Twinkle Park or a different level coming up as my choice for a generation's representation of Sonic Adventure, but, you know, this is also a really cool level. The 2D Sonic uh, Speed Highway was really cool. Yeah, that was my favorite part about that game is going into a level with a different sort of Sonic. So if it was a... It like, I also like side-scrolling through City Escape and the, the slightly yeah. different music where they give it more of a Genesis feel. Yeah, that one was really good, too. Careful with the uh, loop-de-loops being in a ball. Sometimes I think you fall. Ooh, secret. No, 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 no! Why didn't Whoa. it work? I think you need to wait a little bit longer before you did that next homing attack. Blast off! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And this is why I think they probably picked this level, because this, this level definitely has a lot more spectacle than most of the other stages in this game. Especially it's so with this hard part. to control this part. Oh, that's why. You don't have to keep holding. You just have to press left and right. He runs on his own. Oh, yeah. That's what threw me off. Ow. Well, that had to hurt. Oh, it did. It's like a total vibe change here. Yeah, I really like this this part of the level. It's it's a little more open and the music's so chill. I wonder if originally these were oh. meant to be different levels. Darn. But they combine them toward the end. Oh, what? <laughs> yeah, try and wait a little bit longer and move a little closer to your target. The range on the homing attack, it'll feel a lot shorter than the newer games. It almost feels like this oh. was... Oh! Oh, that's cool. It almost feels like this is another part of Station Square. Yeah. Gotta ring the bell for good service, you know? Got to. Yeah, not bad. Not bad, he says. I appreciate that, Sonic. A little boat of confidence. All right, so. Oh yeah, so do you see how they they sort of brought that together? You were just on the other side of Station Square, technically. Yeah. I'm that's a, that's a cool little touch that I have not noticed in the first 400 times I played this game. <laughs> so where to next? Maybe you have to find Amy. She should still be in this city. Hmm. In Maybe this check city, the casino side of the city. That was my first thought. I always pick the wrong door. Always. It never fails.
Amy! Oh, man! Where can she be? Ah! Sonic! Help! I'll cut him off at the Mystic Ruins! Alright, so to the Mystic Ruins. That's actually where I wanted to go in the first place. I saw you landing on that little pillar there. That's a saucy little move. Let me go, you hump and jump! I mean it! Hey there, bull brain! You better give Amy to me or I'll squash ya! Hey, what's happening here? I've lost her again! Okay, so I think I know exactly where we need to go. We need to chase down that ship! Let's and see now if I this think way is open now. We shall see. Yeah. All right, so this is a cool little area, the Mystic Ruins. I like how you can go to Angel Island, where Knuckles guards the Master Emerald. Okay, let's check it out. Man, it is just, I, hub worlds need to be in most games where you have uh, an action hero with like a large move set. It's just so cool to test out their move set. So here's the Master Emerald. Looks like it's missing a chunk of it. <laughs> like someone just yeah. took a bite out of it. <laughs> but I suppose we'll learn more about that in Knuckles' story. Oh, look at that. Did you see that green light to the left? Yeah, I saw this, though. I wanted to see what this is all about. There's a monkey in a cage here. I wonder what we need to do. But the green light will probably help us solve that. This is the ancient light. Try the light speed dash toward the enemy. With this, you can now do the light speed attack. The light speed attack. If only that monkey guard wasn't there. Oh, well maybe he won't be for very long. Oh, wow. <laughs> he just destroyed the cage. That's one way to do it. All right, the Red Mountain. This is one of my favorite stages of this game. You gotta chase that egg carrier. You're collecting a lot of animals, no gorillas. I, I'm gonna need you to get on that, my boy. Yeah, I'm gonna need some gorillas to show up. I don't know why I <laughs> wanted to do that. <laughs> Hey man, that's one way to do it. Gotta do it in style. It doesn't look like homing attacks oh! would work with those guys. Their helicopter blades just swinging, but somehow it does. Whoa! That's awesome! Sweet! Man, I'm getting life after life after life. It'd be funny if one of these animals was like a something, Whoa. something they totally should have done with some of these animals that you collect is make little like tiny hedgehog versions of the main characters or like a little hedgehog version of shadow <laughs> yeah that'd be pretty funny all right let's uh see what's down here as well whoa oh wait a second Another life! 
Oh, we in the jump pad. Nice. And we're taking all the cool routes in this level. Right over the fire. Yeah, I really like this level. Oh, careful here, though. Now if we fall, it's kaput. Oh, man, that was dangerous. Oh, but it's worth it, because I got a gorilla. We, sh we should uh, we should start naming them. Like I'll, uh, I okay, want to name here. that one Harold Kong. Uh, <laughs> I was going to say Donkey Kong, Diddy Kong, <laughs> Chunky Kong. <laughs> No, like, go what down about, the like, list. Dennis Kong? Dennis Kong. <laughs> Kevin Kong. No, because then he has the same initials as DK. Yeah, I get that all the time. <laughs> that was actually... Did you know that was actually Donkey Kong's original name was Dennis? And then they were just like, no, how about Donkey? That's Something like that. Not true at all, by the way. Yeah, there's a lot of those, like, little rumors that come about to, you know... Allegedly, oh. Kirby was named after a lawyer. It's like, I don't know if that... I don't, I don't know if that's true. Oh, I heard that actually was true, but... Let's go with the running shoes, though. Yeah, I don't know, it's just like, no... We we need to just have a sit-down with people, or they, like, they have, need to have, like, a live stream. A Nintendo Direct, just <laughs> addressing all of this. This is our way of, uh, <laughs> advocating for another Nintendo Direct. <laughs> long, long has it been since the days of a Nintendo Direct. All right, we'll name him Gerald Kong. Gerald Kong. Gerald Kong. G K. <laughs> Gerald Kong. <laughs> no. Barely didn't make that. Man, you could just see Matthew kind of getting a grasp of how this game works and how to control Sonic as we keep going through the levels, and there's just a million different ways to get from point A to point B, so it's so much fun to just try different different strategies. So you can you can light speed dash there, or if you know what you're doing, just a little little one two punch of the spin dash and the jump. Nice. You see that tiny hill there, and Matthew uses it to jump over everything that is blocking him. Nice. Yes! Yes! And there it is, another stage in the books. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Here we go again. Will we succeed this time? We'll have to watch out for the uh, the the snot rocket, <laughs> as it were. <laughs> <laughs> the snocket, you mean? <laughs> uh, Tails is flying a different ship this time. It's the Tornado 2. He had to go build a new one, I guess. Man, we'll learn more about that in Tails' story. The cool thing about the where the characters split and reunite is that you get to see their different perspectives and what they were up to in the meantime as you explore different storylines. So we'll get to Tails' story soon enough, but we gotta see the Blue Hedgehog story all the way through. Fire away! 
you're becoming more like your father. <laughs> All these Star Fox references. It feels like Star Fox... It, it doesn't seem like people make games like this anymore. Rail shooters? Yeah, no. Yeah, or at least when you're, where you're in the sky. But yeah, rail shooters at all. Yeah, it seems like they're more arcade-style games for a lot of people. Yeah, and I guess people just haven't found like a way to make that translate to regular games. Oh, what's happening here? All range mode! <laughs> I'll stop at some point. But it's kind of interesting. Say something about the G diffuser. The, around the time where I really started to get into video games, I was stuck on this game and on the Star Fox games. There was like a certain phase in my life where I was just, I guess, really into anthropomorphic animals going on serious adventures. <laughs> That's what it's all about, man. That's what it's all about. Just wasn't getting that gritty story I was looking for from Super Mario Sunshine. Mario! Hey, you, you gotta go more the Donkey Kong 64 route. Oh man, yeah. King K. Roll was scary in that game. He really was. The, the yeah, and you always felt bad when you quit the game because it just played that little animation oh, and he of blows taking up the over island, the world. Yeah, yeah it's, it's kind of a uh, rare. Games always did that. It was it was kind of sad. The music was scary. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, these rockets are flying at you. They're no joke. Alright, we must do battle with the snot rocket once more. The snot it. Oh, we didn't battle it before. What's going on? Oh! I wonder if you'd lose Blast! In, in one hit if you got hit by that. I wonder if you could just take the hit and keep firing at it. You know? Yeah, but I'm, I'm not sure. Last time it took out the plane in one shot. The snock it has been downed. Get a little, gave it a little dose of decongestant, if, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> Alrighty, we're in! We gotta land on the egg carrier. Whoops. Uh, I forgot something. What's that? There's no landing gear in this mode. What? Wow! This thing is really huge! No time to gawk now! We need to find Amy! You're right, my friend. So here we go! Yeah, no time for gawking, Tails. The gawking can wait. Don't get too many ideas, you fools! You haven't seen the power this vessel really has! Get a load of this! It harder for us to get to the bridge. I hate it when he doesn't listen. <laughs> I bet you weren't expecting this. The only way you can get to me is through the sky deck. I doubt if you can figure this one out. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I'll show you. Bring it on. To the sky deck. This must be the way to the sky deck. <laughs> sure hard to find. We found it, guys. We found it. The mystery no of the sky deck has been solved. Oh, here we go, though. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Which way are we going? To the right? You go that way. It's too hard to navigate without seeing anything. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Tails. I've been betrayed! <laughs> Look at when you hit it slow. It just slowly... Moves to the top. This music track is epic. Oh yeah, I, I love this level. 
Wait a second. <laughs> I'm trying not to use the <laughs> homing attack. Oh, ah, man. I miss. Oh. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> There we go. Come to me, my animal friends, while we wait for my other animal friend. The the bigger one with the shoes. <laughs> Should be coming any second now. It's like sometimes you come right back and then other times it takes forever. Yeah, I don't know. Tails is protesting because you got a... Uh viciously taken down. How about I just drop down? Okay, thanks. <laughs> oh, another life. Whoop! <laughs> I didn't want to go this way, but this will work. Oh, whoops. Oh no! You gotta kind of push into the cylinder, but I guess now you get to go the other way. Man, sometimes it just seems like if if you don't do it when you're supposed to, you can't make it. You can try turning the camera with the shoulder buttons. It's like such a weird placement. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. I would stand in the where the circle is. That's what I did the very first time. It's like up here. It looks like. There we go. Oh, <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Valiant effort, tails. Oh no. no! 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 I guess let's go this way. <laughs> See what that's all about. Whoa. Whoa! That's cool. I'm glad we lost. Oh. Tried to get the running shoes. Eh, it's kind of more of a liability in this level. <laughs> this is such a strange level from uh, how it's set up. Can I even get up here? Yeah, I guess I can. No, 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 no. What? It's okay, you're good. <laughs> Somehow I always end up hitting you. Oh, I thought you were, like, right here. I thought I was, too. Yes! I don't know how we ended up here. 
When the ship increases speed, hold on to something. What is going on? I think you can homing attack those things and hold on to them. Let's go this way, Tails. Oh no. Oh no. Or I'm taking hang out on these to. rockets though. These turrets. So they disappeared. I was doing a good job. One ring? From a capsule? I've never seen that before. There's random ones that can give you like 1, 20, 40, so on and so forth. Oh! Darn. Let's go. Come on, Tails. Is it gonna come back around? Get him! Yeah! <laughs> Got it, boy! This level is so cool. I love all the different phases. Over here. Oh, nice. <laughs> Except I fell through the floor there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Boy, let's go. Come on. <laughs> nice. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back in it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Hey man, I got him, didn't I? I made it! Nice. <laughs> oh. Oh, very nice maneuvering, my friend. Oh no! Oh no. Oh man, all this falling debris. I'm waiting for you to fall out of one of those. <laughs> Whoa! Man. He's a dangerous man. No! Oh, well, that's cool at least. Yeah, some springs are just uh, Sonic's eye balls are gone. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> uh. Do you constantly hear that sound effect? Of <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Also, his shadow is kind of funny. It's like a dot on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> no pupils and no shadow. Oh, man, you can kind of fall out of that part even normally. No! Oh! There you are. Oh. Oh. oh! Wait, what? What is going on? I don't know, this part's always been weird. 
I don't think I'm... Okay, there we go. Can't leave my mate behind. What happens if you do it? Let's find out. Nothing. But I can mess with you in the background here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Is that it? It might be. But let's check out the bridge. Alright, well this is where our episode will end. Join us next time as we check out the bridge. What is on there? Is the bridge made out of wood or metal? All these many mysteries and more answered on the next episode of Sonic Adventure.